I should give him something. Beautiful angels, how are you all doing? I hope you're all doing fine. I'm also doing so very well, as you can see. So, if you're new here, I'm coming at you <laughs> from Mali, Segu. <laughs> oh my goodness. Coming at you from Segu, one of the historical towns here in Mali. So, all of you, welcome to Mali, Segu. Oh my goodness, I'm so freaking happy to be here. So, you guys, come along with me. My first day in Segu. Let's go to the Segu Shugu. Meaning Segu Market. <laughs> Bonjour, pardon, pardon. <laughs> All right, so let's go to the market. First impressions I can say Shegu seems calmer and more relaxed in terms of aggressiveness and population size. They have quite a number of trees as well and the buildings here are much more lower compared to Bamako and most essentially their ambience seems much more indigenously traditional. So let me tell you something. When I got to the Jara bus station, the man behind, he was the one I came with. So he just, you know, he called the one who was supposed to come and pick him and said I should join them freely. That is how kind and hospitable Malians are. They are so hospitable. Like, free ride though, I'm not spending money. Like, I have to save my body for something else, you guys. Give them a round of applause. Merci beaucoup. <laughs> merci, merci, merci. <laughs> oh, they are so kind. If they want to be kind, they are super kind. The man told me that's a water storage facility. The shape is incredible, isn't it? So there's a police checkpoint, so we had to slow down. Wow, you can see there are lots of camels here as well. Dandera in Bamako. Another impression the architectural design and color is almost the same as Bamako. You know that cream color. So if you're very keen, you realize that the theme color for the Malians is cream or earthy colors, and it's incredible how almost all their buildings are painted as such. The region of Segu. Mali has eight regions, but I heard uh, currently it has been expanded to 19. But the previous ones are eight, and Segu is part of the region. Wow, the orange and ash color looks good on that building. What do you think? Yeah, so as you can see, the colors are still earthy and creamy, and it's so incredible and beautiful. And what you see in front of us are people being ridden by the camel to the market, okay? And ahead of us, you can see that we have Bank of Africa signpost. So, Bank of Africa is here and it's in Ghana as well. So, you guys come along with me and let's go to the 
market you can see this building ahead of us is giving kind of like a Bamako vibe although the vibe here is mostly like that village township vibe you know that vibe that when you're getting closer you feel like okay everything indigenous everything traditional that i need i am getting it here today especially food the food that you don't normally get in Bamako, you will get it here today all right so soon too soon we have arrived in the market and first impression it doesn't look that busy like the big market in bamako even as you are approaching it yeah so in bamako when you're approaching the market you know that oh my god this place is gonna be very busy by here you just know that it is that calm village market that you are approaching and you can also see that here the people are more reserved and most of the women are transporting their goods to the markets with the camel you do you're just going to get your staples rest assured you get your staples you also be able to get everything indigenous every food you have been craving for in the city that you cannot really get that tastefulness like this bread <laughs> of it in the city you are going to get it here in this market so you guys come along with me and let's go explore this beautiful traditional market of the malian people so the men with the car have been so helpful and i'm really grateful so right now i'm in the market and i had to join this camel trailer transporting the women and their goods to the main oh market guys, you guys it has been so thrilling and they did it for free you guys Okay, so this is one of the means of uh, transporting their goods from point to point. So, as you can see, I'm sitting on this and we are heading to the bank of the river where we have women transporting their goods across the river to the market. So you guys come along with me, look what I am sitting <laughs> I'm being ridden by the cabin. I'm enjoying it, man. So this is the Shegu 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 Market. <laughs> ah, wow! Such an adventure, you guys. Wow. So here in Shegu, what food can I uh, try? You guys, drop a comment and let me know. Ah, okay. So welcome to the Shegu market. Everyone is gathered around just looking at me. Some are complaining, some are happy. And <laughs> some are just looking at me like I'm a crazy woman. <laughs> but they are beautiful people. Eh? Wow! For myself. Yes. Oh, you see? Jugu, jugu. Oh. Oh, don't be just like that. Why? This is how the market looks. I will laugh. So if you've been watching my videos you realize that this market is quite different from that of the big markets in Bamako in terms of business you can see here we have a lot of camels here the only thing similar is the building up there yeah look at the building in the market wow I don't know whether they are shops but yeah, Abana? I am Abana. Ah, okay. They are selling the street food. Wow. Lisa. They found this one. I said, yeah. I said, yeah. I said, yeah. I said, yeah. I'm done enjoying myself with a camel. Eh? Hmm. 
Arriving, the first thing I decided to taste is this locally made drink from Millet. It tasted much more like something we call Lamuji in Ghana. Wow, Juguji. Juguji. Muguji. I don't know what it is made of. It's very sweet. What is it made of? It's made of Millet. Uh, yes, millet, yes, yes. Ah, millet. Oh, okay, wow. Are you Ghanaian or yeah, Nigerian? Yeah. Nigerian? Ah! Oh, yeah. Ghana. Where is your name? Mabel, what are you doing? You are working here? Yes, I'm doing business here. Oh, like you take me around? Yes, yes, I can. Okay, then let's go. Uh, so you say you you watch your bag because uh, 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 yes. Wow, everywhere. Because you can see what has your bag. <laughs> yes. You can watch your telephone, you can put it in Everywhere, everywhere there is. We have a lot of Ghanaians here, they are selling new clothes. Show me! Yes. Okay! <laughs> Guys, they are coming to enjoy. He's taking us to where the Ghanaians are. So they said uh, the, uh, there's a river here. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, okay, I want to go to the river first. Okay. Because maybe that one they will close early, right? The women coming to sell in the market. Are you not going to do something? I'm doing something, boy. Oh. This is my place. This is where I live. Okay. No, no. Okay, okay. I hope I'm not disturbing you. I I think I'm going to be there. I'm going to be there. I'm going to be there. Ah, these people. They can worry, oh. Wow. This market is so cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. traditional markets. Yeah. Uh -huh. They have soaps, yeah. vegetables. Yeah, they like soap, they like soap. Every time they are river washing clothes. Oh, okay. Yeah. This river? Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Is food expensive here? No. Food is not expensive. Wow. Oh, that is fish. This one they use it for drinks. Oh, okay. Can caliber. Hey, let me see. You see, this one is can caliber. This one? Fala. Ah, this one is can caliber. It's for drink? Yes. They cook it for drink. What about this one? This one is the food. Sell food. Can you buy this one? No, I want to have that one. Yeah. No. This one? They don't have all black. Yes. See their colors. Well, only that color. Ah. Yes, yes, yes. Ah. Is it for a female? For everyone. <laughs> you guys, <please. laughs> how 
does it look? Same sir? Oh. Uh, 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 750. 750. Oh, it's too expensive. Sexa Sebona. It's good. If I don't take care, I'll sleep here. I have to go back to Bamako. <laughs> yes. You said it's nice. <laughs> okay, if you say so, guys, what do you think? But I, I would have preferred it to be all black. But it's okay. Alright, let's. Can I be the right? I'm very I'm leaving. I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm dashing you my own. Great man. You are rich. You are rich. You are rich. You are You are rich. You are You are rich. You are You what is this? Yeah. This shirt. Ah. Okay. I would like to carry this one to Ghana. So the green powder substance is called Fakoye in Mali and I you in Ghana. Here in Mali, they use it to do stew for rice. Yes, 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 yes. Baobab. Yes, yes. I know this one. This is not far from here. No, 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 no. We are going to the bank of the river. So here is the Shegu market. You guys, I am showing you places, you guys. So start giving the video a thumbs up and do not forget to subscribe. Let me take a thumbnail. Here we are in the Shegu market. Whoa. Beautiful people. Alright, so as you can see, this part of the market is full of cereals and legumes. They said they are known for making these pots. This one. Do they make them here? Wow, you guys, welcome to the Riverbank Market here in Shegu. The biggest market in Shegu. And it is only held on Mondays. And today is a Monday and I am here to show you stuff. Wow. C'est pas fait, mais toi. They like a lot of herbs too here. See this side, they are selling a lot of herbs. But they don't... I'm working. Yeah, what is this? Ça fait quoi? Non, non, non. Non, non, non. Non, non, non. C'est non, non, non. Do you know what it is? <laughs> Wow, this is what they use to transport their goods mostly. As you can see, they have even overloaded this one. It cannot even move. That feels so cruel. Oh my goodness. Don't come and hit me. Yo. Wow. Alright, so here we are again at the Niger River. The Niger River passes through Bamako to Shegu and okay, the southeastern part of the country. That's what I read on the internet. So I want to try and get to these people. Mm -hmm. Wow, these boats. Wow, I like your dress. C'est bien. <laughs> wow, he said he's taking a photograph. Alright, then I think I'll have to do some as well. Hi, good morning. <laughs> Alright, the sun is a bit down. That is so good for my GoPro. Then we go around the market square and I show you what these people are particularly known for. They said they are known for their fishing and poultry and their market. And also the old town of Segu called the Segu Koro. Is this not Segu Koro? The old town. Sorry? Then it's very far. Hey, the water is it deep here? Yeah? No, it's not deep. It's not deep. <laughs> Sorry. You can come close. Hello. Hey, done, 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 done. Done, done. You say you can go to the other side. Why? 
Padra, how are you? The books that you are seeing here, they are the books that transport the people, the women, the market women, they are loads from the other side of the river, across the river, to the very markets here. just because of me they are looking at me but look at the river oh my goodness it's so huge that is inside the boat they have a generator there wow this is still is pumping water out of the oh, a little bit of riding water. on the boat yeah they said they will take you along but you get them how much? Come here. The women have finished uploading their loads before I came. I didn't come early. I wanted to come and show you how they offload everything. Where's my shoe? Mombo. <laughs> Mombo. <laughs> you guys, look at my outfits of the day. I just got this handmade here in Shegu by the people of Shegu. And I bought it from them. In Mali, out of vlogging is not such a thing. So they normally do stare a lot at vloggers. Alright, so I'm going to check if I can afford the boat ride. Auntie, come here. Oh, several laval, Olivier, Olivier, seven thousand. Just around this place. Oh, it's okay. Oh. I'll go like that. So this is what they use for the women. Yeah, Okay. Bonjour. Ça va bien? Hey, no. I want to sit in this set meal. Oh no. Me, I just want to like French fry. I just sit in there. Yeah, that's all. I don't want to go far. No problem. I don't have that kind of money. I cannot sleep here. I have to go back. Just here. No, I'm going far. Just here. People have come to the market, they have bought their goods from the market and they are loading it into the boat. So they will transport it across the river. The village there is called Bar Coffee. Oh my goodness. Bar Coffee. Have you heard? Bar Coffee. You see? They will load everything here. These guys are very hard working. Hard working guys. You see someone who has bought their goods. They are coming to load it with the boat. Oh, thank you all so much, eh? Thank you so much, eh? And they are laughing at me. Oh, God. They are laughing at me. I left something. They said this hotel here. Hotel Esplanade. They are coming to have a festival here, so they are decorating every place. And that place, too, they are working on the preparation for the festival that is coming off in February. I wish I could come and show you. So they say these people are known for their poetry. Wow, it's so nice. But there's no way here. The market is so fine. They have strange stuff. Things that I've not seen before. Look at the pots. That is what they are known for. So they are known for their poultry. Oh, fish. Wow. Uh, look at the pots. What are they doing there? That place. That place is fish. Okay, pots. Mm, interesting market. They have fish here plenty. Ah, uh, because of the river. Wow. Interesting people. This thing, we were eating it. <laughs> Pregnant women eat it a lot in Ghana. <laughs> so this is for the festival. 
Wow, you guys look. Wow, they have decorated it with mud. What is it called? Wow, you guys, this is where they are preparing for the festival to take place. Woo! Wow, look at what they have done here. It's so nice. Guys, this is beautiful. Sorry, pardon. <laughs> wow, you guys, look at this. Wow, this will be an interesting festival. Look at what they have used to, you know, create the shapes for the cubicles. Wow. <laughs> oh, look at look at how they have decorated it with mud. You see? Wow. Oh. Hey. Look at this one too. Wow. These people are very artistic, talented people. They like you know these things. You find them in Genie and Tumbuktu. Look at that. I hope the camera is on. Look, look, look how beautiful it looks. They use mud to do it. Wow. Is it a room? What do they do there? People go there and take pictures. Then let me also take a picture. Hey, you said I shouldn't put my phone at my back today, dear. I've worried you. Let me just take the picture. My space is finished. Can you imagine? People are just looking at me. The way they are looking at me, guys, it's really weird. Oh, can this thing show? Ooh. I came to say, and this is what I saw. So we're just taking a picture. Yeah, done. Stephanie. Merci. How many people? Our girlfriend, how are you? Did you Oh, so this is another side of the market. Vegetables, fish. Not if I were cooking, like I would have bought some vegetables here. Oh my goodness, look at their market uh, cubicles. This, oh, pardon, pardon. These are houses, so this is, this is where people sleep. People's homes, you guys. It's interesting. If I want to sleep here, would they allow me? Somebody's house. Oh, if they can allow me to come and spend a day with them. I want dormi. Wow, we got a camels. We have the are You eat, you don't know what to do to yourself. Look at fish. Fish. And onions. Wow. Why is this kente? They made it in Mali. Okay. We do something in our village. I sat on this when I was coming. <laughs> I sat on it. Mm. Wow, interesting markets. You see? What is that? They call it gato. Gato, cake. No, it's just like buns, like oh. meat pies. Yeah. Fresh fish? Wow. Hey, this soap there is everywhere. This one. Wow. They like washing. Wow. So welcome to Segu, their beloved market. Medicine. What kind of medicine? I Oh, I don't have malaria. I don't have malaria. Thank you. This is like Ongo. They use it for Yes, how much? This place they can chew raw cassava. They add salt to it. 
This is Zimini. Combien? Don't worry. Is that right? Don't worry. Zimini. Zimini. You guys. Zimini. Eh? It's hard though. How do they eat it? This food is very strong. They used to do what? Ghana man. Yes, they are not friendly. You that you are Ghanaian and I'm happy to meet you. This old man. Okay, I'll not go to any Ghanaian again. Ghanaians are not friendly. Sometimes you will meet them they don't like Oh no, it's not fair. Malians, even they don't know you, they are very friendly. Oh no, where's your place? What are you selling? Oh, me, I don't have a baby. Well, I just met a brother from Ghana, you guys. Yeah, so, yeah. oh my goodness, it's good to meet someone from your yes. own country when you're outside your country. Yes. Like, oh my god, that's oh your god, brother. Yeah, no, 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 you are a very good fan. <laughs> oh, thank you, thank, thank you, you very thank much. you. Good to meet you. Oh. Now we are, we are family. Because, family. Yes, you become like brothers and sisters. Assistance. Exactly, that is how it's supposed to be. Yes. But some I, people. This is oh, nice yeah. man. He's a nice man. Uh, oh, yeah, you are such a nice uh, man. I know. Uh, yes, I know. I, I know. <laughs> okay, nice to meet yes, you. Yes, <laughs> very good. Yes. No, no, no. <laughs> no, you are my sister. Yes, I'm your sister. I love you. Oh. All right, so finally, I've decided to get some local food. <laughs> Food. Everything is Kevin. I have my own spoon. This food, they are not used. I don't want to use their spoon. So they say this tea is made of onions and some vegetables. Okay, how much? Okay. I'm just like giving some food. What is this? Ghana. They don't speak English, they speak French. How do I get payment? We are trying. Pepe. Go to look for the other. Mm -hmm. Alright guys, I'll get back to you when I'm done eating. These are all um, onions, pepper and meat. It tastes so good. Very delicious. Natural. <laughs> this place, everywhere you go, that I told them them begging for something. Always when you're out, you need to have something to give out to the children. Unfortunately, I've said a lot of things in the morning right now. I don't have enough. When I first came here, because I didn't understand their language and everything, they overcharged me a lot. The transportation means I was using was too expensive. And um, internet has consumed all my money. So I'm ending it here. Thank you all so much for joining. Do want to subscribe, like the video, and also leave beautiful comments. You guys speak everything. Wow, guys. Oh. I always meet good people. He's a Nigerian. I met him, and he's taking care of me now. He's going to drop me by the roadside, and I take a bus to Bamako. I always meet nice people. The woman is riding the bike. Wow. That woman is a holy.